Good evening and thanks for joining us for 27 News at 6. I'm Mackenzie Davis. Republican Attorney General Chris Kobach says a new law prevents transgender people from changing their sex on their driver's licenses, but the Democratic governor has refused to enforce it. Now the case is going to court. 27 News reporter Gabriel Johnson explains the lawsuit. Kansas Attorney General Chris Kobach is trying to block the governor's efforts to help transgender people. Kobach appearing on our Inside Kansas Politics show. She's defying the clear language of the law and you know you can't just veto a bill and then get overridden and pretend as if your veto succeeded. Uh, so we will be uh, suing to enforce the letter of the law. The law defines sex as male and female and is assigned to everyone at birth. This has caused frustration among the LGBTQ plus community. One person saying it sends a dangerous message. It tells everyone that we're not welcome here for different especially for transgender Kansans, especially for the youth who are probably now going to up and leave when they turn 18 and get a chance. It tells everybody that the law is not on our side if we're a part of a marginalized community. And as a result, many trans people in the state are fearful and contemplating other options. I think it's vital that we're here and if we're erased from this state, I can't imagine I'd want to be here anymore because I would lose that community and all of my friends and family. Gabriel Johnson reporting now the Women's Bill of Rights includes many other specifications, but this lawsuit just targets driver's licenses. A reminder to join us each Sunday morning for Inside Kansas Politics here on 27 KSNT. The show airs at 730 in the morning.